still stand strong. We remember the wolves that roam the land, the deer that graze on the fields, the squirrels that spread the seeds of the mighty trees that stand before us, the roaming rivers, the flowing oceans, the ever-growing trees, Please accept these offerings that my fellow believers bring to you now. of the land. We have given you offerings of the land, whether it be food, drink, or of the native spirits that like tobacco. Please accept this and understand that we only mean good in this gathering of so-called heathens. These pagans that worship the gods of old. For we have come here on this first night of Yule to honor the spirits of the land, the gods of old. We will only show respect and the honor that we carry from day to day. Out of the land of the tear. Hail the land of the tear. Hail the land of the tear. Hello, 
anybody that's been to a gathering of Thanksgiving in the last year has done this. But the story started uh, last fall in Idaho. General bloat. I had some honey left over, and I just felt the call to honor, honor Snooka. So when I started that first offering here in Ohio last year, I thought it was just going to be a one, one-time thing. I kept going. I've done it at every single gathering I've been to in the past year. But I also know that come the home, when we have our land, first gathering on the land, we'll bring rocks, build a cairn, and that cairn won't go away at the end of the weekend. It'll continue to grow. As we gather, every single time, that cairn will grow. True testament to all the feelings here, everyone, we all come from different backgrounds, different places, different beliefs but we all get along. These gatherings are incredible. Where we can all come here, be ourselves, knowing the person next to you, the person you're talking to, might not think the same thing about some things, might have completely different experiences. None of that matters. What matters is what brings us together. So when we add the land, that caring will grow and grow as this community grows and grows. True honor to everyone that comes to these gatherings. It's a true way to honor Snowflake. I'll start off just, if you have a rock from home, come place it in between the candles. Thank you for watching over us. We honor you with this cream to soothe any tempers that may come. Hail Snowtra! Hail, Hail Snowtra! Hail the folk! Hail, Hail the folk!
We come tonight to honor Frigg, our all mother. It is on tonight when Frigg gives birth to her sons. We all know her as the mother who wailed for her beloved Baldur. But many forget Freya's warning. Frigg is the knower of all fates, though she does not share them. She's the only one who can sit on Odin's high seat. She is his partner in all things. There must be balance. The divine feminine, the divine masculine. We come tonight on this Yule evening to honor her, our cloud weaver, our secret keeper, our all mother. It is a love from our hearts that we give to you. We all come from the sacred womb. We have all come from her womb. She has bled for us. She has cried for us. She has shared in our joys and our deepest sorrows. May you call on the lines of your feminine ancestors, your Desir, call on their strength and their wisdom. May it guide you to light the fires bright in your homes, to chase away the darkness of winter, to honor their knowledge, their sacrifices, and all that they have passed on, good and bad, to you. I light this candle in honor of all the ancestors that have come before me. I honor the Desir and Frigg, and I call on the Norns. Guide us, let us light our fires, and let us teach our children to honor you as well. Let us chant your name. Pull us, Frigg, into your distaff. Twist us in your wheel. Wise Frigg, weave us into your web of weird. Asia Queen, Cloud Weaver, Sky Mother, Frigg, Frigg, Frigg. Hail Frigg! Hail Frigg! Hail the Desir! Hail the Desir! And may we pass that on to our bones and blood. Hail Frigg! Hail Frigg! Frigg! Yee -hee! May all who gather around our fires come together in love and peace and strength. For that is the mother's wish, that all will be abundant, prosperous, healthy, and above all, full of love and joy. Go now with your flames, light your fires, teach your children, hold your community, and love beyond belief and know that the strength of your ancestors, your Desir, are beating and burning always inside of you. In honor of Frigg, live each day, each meaningful task, mindless task be done in love. That is your offering to her. Every time you fold someone's clothes, make a bed, cook a meal, kiss away a hurt, do the dishes or wash the floors, those are offerings to your mother. And never forget, she's always watching, she's always listening, and she's always there.
think we are perfectly okay saying it's sunrise because it has been a long, long night, which is the reason we are here and the reason we were doing this was to celebrate one of the longest nights of the year to really soak in how different winter time is to summer, where summer lasts almost endlessly with sunlight and activities and, you know, just the, the warm, you know, beautiful night sky. But the night that we just went through was so much different. It was dark, it was long, it was cold, but we got through it together. We got through it by laughing, by telling stories, by listening to music, by literally doing anything to get through the night. And we do this not only to connect to our ancestors, but to connect to gods. And Heimdall is one of those deities that we can connect with tonight as Heimdall sacrifices his sleep to protect Asgard and protect the gods and to watch for Ragnarok. So we signal the horn to recognize Heimdall. We offer our sleep to recognize Heimdall. But also we use this time of year and this ritual that we've done every Yule so far to honor Suna, the goddess of the sun, as this sun rising symbolizes the next year, the next cycle. And so as we look into this fire, as we think about sleep, we also look forward to the new year. Let's have a nice calm. Hail Suna and Hail Heimdall, and then let's go to bed. Hail. Hail Suna. Hail Heimdall. Hail Heimdall. Happy you all. Happy you all. All right, good night. Creatures of Midgard, this is a time of stillness. But there are beings who awaken in this season with vigor and ferocity. Gods and spirits of rushing avalanche and whistling arrow. We gather here today to honor the god Ulur. Uller is a winter god, the god of many things. He's a god of games, duels, oaths, hunters, and he's a god of glory. There are many ways for us humans to gain glory. Champions and hunters of game, warriors, weavers, Heroes and healers, what glory do you seek this next turning of the wheel when the world reawakens? Whatever it is, I ask that Uller accept your offerings today and that he grant you the glory that you seek. You may now come forward and place your offerings to Uller on the platform, liquids in the bowl. Be gentle. Now, in the spirit of the god of games, god of the bow, Mary, our champion from the archery contest yesterday, will ignite your offerings in a blaze of glory to Uller.
don't know quite how glorious this is going to be. <laughs> <laughs> if you feel like taking a couple steps back, wouldn't be unwise. <laughs> right? I'm going to say it's a bit chilly. Mary, take it away. allow the blessings to flow through and into each person here. Oh! And that concludes our come run. Go in peace, unity, and love, always. As I call them now to the sound of bells. Spirits, join us around the fire. Spirits of the trees, of the stars, of the mud, of the water, the animals, the birds, the wolves, the deer. Join us around this fire. Hear our call as you did the first night of this Yule gathering and celebration. We also honored the ancestors with plates of food. We honor the ancestors with candles and bells. We honor the ancestors with our memories. We give them this food so they may feast with us as if this is the halls of Valhalla. This is the halls of the slain in Helheim or in the hall of Thor where our ancestors lie. Feast with us ancestors, deep in the ground or deep in the sky. Hail to the ancestors. We are here now for the gods but not just any God, the chief God, the All Father. I have a drink for him, as it is Yule. 
I have eggnog with a depiction of your face, Odin. I hope you enjoy this strong drink as you do not feast upon food, but only of beverages. I ask my warriors now to join themselves on the pedestals where they may hail Odin even louder. But as these pots open up, please come through and give your offerings to Odin as the fire may carry it above to his hall, to Ratsgjolf where he watches us, where Haugen and Maun and Fly, where Gaily and Frankie sit. Please now bring offerings to the fire. Hangatir, Krafnagof, Battle Screamer, Destroyer, Melter of Worlds, Odin. Feel the flames reach high as our offerings reach to you, Odin. Feel the embers head to the sky as our ancestors once did. You have given us life as your brothers when you traveled around, as you flew your father and sacrificed your eye. One thing you have given us, Odin, is advice in the form of your words, the words of Hadi. That is what we call to tonight as we remember your teachings, but also the teachings of all gray beards and gray hair that lived on and passed down to us so that we may learn. Lotfafnir, you heard the words of Odin. Now hear them as they come from our mouths. We counsel you, Lotfafnir, and Odin's hall we heard them so. We counsel you, Lotfafnir, and Odin's hall we heard them so. The first line told to Lotfafnir, never rise in darkness unless to spy on your enemies. We counsel you, Lotfafnir, and Odin's hall we heard them so. Never sleep in the arms of sorcery, or they will lock your limbs. We, we counsel you, Lord Fafnir, and Odin's hall we heard him so. Never seduce another's lovers with whispers in their ear. We counsel you, Lord Fafnir, and Odin's hall we heard him so. Always prepare to travel by land or sea. We counsel you, Lord Fafnir, and Odin's hall we heard him so. Never will your deeds prosper from evil beings. We counsel you, Lord Fafnir, and Odin's hall we heard them so. Always visit friends, or the roads will be grown with weeds. We counsel you, Lord Fafnir, and Odin's hall we heard them so. Learn healing spells if you wish to live a long and happy life. We counsel you, Lord Fafnir, and Odin's hall we heard them so. Loneliness will eat your heart if your hearth is empty. We counsel you, Lord Fafnir, and Odin's hall we heard them so. Never speak with a fool, for they will always whisper lies in your ear. We, we counsel you, Lord Fafnir, and Odin's hall we heard them so. Keep goodness in your heart if you wish to win a good reputation. We counsel you, Lord Fafnir, and Odin's hall we heard them so. Never fight a battle with a lesser man. We counsel you, Lord Fafnir, and Odin's hall we heard them so. Build your own fires and learn to live for yourself. We counsel you, Lord Fafnir, and Odin's hall we heard them so. Never give your enemies peace while they sleep. We counsel you, Lord Fafnir, and Odin's hall we heard them so. Never should you cherish bad news, but always celebrate good news. We counsel you, Lord Fafnir, and Odin's hall we heard them so. Never look up in a fight, or your enemy will curse your eyes. We counsel you, Lord Fafnir, and Odin's hall we heard them so. Beware the lives of others and the strength of drink. We counsel you, Lord Fafnir, and Odin's hall we heard them so. Promises to your lovers if you wish to keep them close in your heart. We counsel you, Lord Fafnir, and Odin's hall we heard them so. Never mock or laugh at a wanderer, for it may be Odin in disguise. We counsel you, Lord Fafnir, and Odin's hall we heard them so. Do not become trapped in your grief, or you will live in despair. We counsel you, Lord Fafnir, and Odin's hall we heard them so. When you drink beer, choose the might of the earth. We, we have to you all up here, and all is all we have to do.
God of ecstasy. We feel you. We feel you in our heart racing and the shortness of our breaths. The blood pulsating through our chest. And the spirits in our hearts and the land and the ground. Lord of me, you heard the words of the hobby. Heed them, for at Odin's hall, we heard them so. Oh! Oh! Yeah.